Hey everybody, um, I just thought I'd uh, share this with you. This is my second strike on uh, ScrewTube, as Jesse would like to say. Uh, my first one being uh, courtesy of the Dishonor Network, aka Eliza Posner, for an illegal copyright infringement um, on the truth about Sandy Hook. Yep, yep, I posted the truth about Sandy Hook. Um, I saw that a couple of people were taken down for it on a copyright strike so uh, me and little mama decided to chop it up into 15 parts um, only one of which were flagged which was part one which told us all oh, right and plus the email we got on a network etc etc we knew it was them um, so here's my second one and it was about the Paris shooting in plain sight graphic content that I put up um, basically uh, when I saw the narrative that we were being spoon fed by the mainstream media about this policeman that was allegedly shot at point blank range with an AK-47 I uh, just I weren't buying it I mean I showed it to a few of my friends that are in into firearms and ballistics and they said no way man so on that note I decided to do a little bit of research and find out people that had been shot at point blank range with an AK-47 and made that comparison and it's totally different and the reason I did it is just to get people to scratch their heads and, and question what they're being force fed, spoon fed you know, that was the whole point behind it but anyway I'd, I'd just like to take this time to uh, thank everybody that um, took the time out to uh, watch the video and share it and spread it far and wide I think we got up to about 11 plus thousand views in the first 48 hours which was an amazing achievement um, it's it's here there and everywhere I'd like to thank um, the internet post for getting a hold of it and sticking it up on their channel there it is parachuting in plain sight also um, Michael Rivero, uh, a big advocate of uh, the Sandy Hook Truth Movement. I mean, I know he's well behind the um, the Truth About Sandy Hook documentary. He's he's always talking about it. He always um, discusses it and urges people to go and watch it and open their minds and you know educate themselves on the alternative um, um, perspective of what we're being told by the mainstream media. So hats off to you, Michael Rivero, for that. Um, also, I can't do this video without thanking everybody at FPRN Radio, <laughs> an amazing bunch of people, uh, all that run it, all that are involved, uh, Lies Wide Open, Max Resistance, I mean Monty for getting me onto Zeekly, I mean I love Monty to pieces man, uh, Max Resistance Roundtable is, is just a wonderful thing to listen to and, and, and be a part of, I mean feel free to just jump in and chime in and and put your point across I mean it's, it's a great interactive uh, way of uh, becoming a part of the uh, truth and movement I mean FPR and radio it's all about that but um, let's get back to me um, <laughs> Zeekly you're a cunt all right I'm on Zeekly so don't worry about screw tube or fuck you YouTube or whatever but I'm on here and um, as I said uh, I'm new to this but I've been inspired by um, a lot of the people that I follow on YouTube and have followed on YouTube over the years and uh, it's about time that I've pulled my finger out and started contributing. Big shout out to uh, um, Professor Doom for his consistency with the uh, Sandy Hook um, agenda. I mean he's done some fantastic work and uh, all the power to him and uh, look out for my next video on Zeekly TV. Peace out.